Is mother's milk radioactive? A Nature Portfolio study reported something startling. Traces of uranium were found in every breast milk sample taken from 40 mothers across six districts in Bihar. So, how does this radioactive element even reach a mother's body? Well, uranium is a naturally occurring heavy metal found in the Earth's crust. And when rocks weather over centuries, uranium slowly dissolves into groundwater aquifers. In regions with granitic rock, deep bore wells, or declining water tables, this natural leaching becomes stronger. In human activity, mining, industrial effluents, fly ash, phosphate fertilizers, all of these can increase uranium mobility in soil and water. So when this contaminated water is used for drinking or cooking, small amounts enter the human bloodstream. Now, most uranium is filtered out by the kidneys. But the study shows that a fraction can cross into breast milk, especially in high exposure regions. And the primary danger here is not radiation, but uranium's chemical toxicity. It can cause kidney damage in adults and infants due to lower body weight and developing organs face a higher risk. Additionally, a majority of exposed infants could face non-carcinogenic health risks if exposure continues. But here's the crucial part. Experts are clear breastfeeding must not stop. The detected levels are below most international drinking water guidelines and mother's milk provides unmatched immunity and nutrition. And stopping it would create greater health risks than the uranium exposure currently observed. So the real issue isn't breastfeeding, it is environmental governance. The findings call for groundwater quality monitoring, stricter regulation of industrial and mining effluents and provision for safe drinking water systems. Because ultimately, the mother's milk is not the problem. The problem is the water she is forced to drink.